crossing the battered bridge normally requires a whopping 10 jumps. Two are easily saved with a spin kick around the ropes. Three additional jumps can be saved by using the bridge sway momentum to roll off, unroll midair for a bit of extra air time, and just barely grab the next section. Since we don't have the torch to leave this area as intended, we're gonna have to climb up and around the giant rock wall. We can use this tree to get onto the wall itself in two jumps. To reach the top, we're gonna have to employ some extremely finicky maneuvers that are even harder than they appear. We have to precisely roll clip and punch in some specific spots to get Harry to slowly, but surely, climb up the slopes. That, along with falking on the edge of geometry, which counts as ground, is the basis for the rest of this level. At this point, we would normally do a series of three double jumps, but of course we want to reduce the amount of jumps to a bare minimum. And finally, another one of these rolled clips followed by timed punches to slowly climb a sloped wall. 